In this video, I would like to show you the JavaScript performance with the Building Browser and Puffing Browser on Android devices. Puffing Browser is a remote browser that accelerates web page rendering speed through cloud computing. I'm going to do this demo with a number of devices, Motorola Atrix, Nexus One, and two Huawei IDEOS. I'll run the Building Browser on three of the phones on the left. The one on the rightmost will be running Puffing Browser. In this demo, we'll run the industry standard JavaScript test, V8 Benchmark. V8 Benchmark is a suite of pure JavaScript tests that Google used to tune the JavaScript engine in Google Chrome browser. Please keep in mind, this benchmark reflects pure JavaScript performance, while there are other factors to consider when evaluating the speed of a browser. Let's fire up Android browser and Puffing browser. I've saved the link to the latest version of V8 benchmark, version 6 in the bookmark. I'll start the test on the IDEOS phone running Android browser first. Moved over to see the progress of the test. Then we'll start on Nexus 1 and Atrix. Make sure the test is running. The last, we'll start the test on the IDEOS phone running Puffing Browser. You can see the percentage of the V8 test suite that has been completed. Puffing Browser is running ahead, 78% completed, 89%, 100% done. Puffing Browser has finished the test suite and scored 2,335 points. The final score is computed as the geometric mean of the individual results. Higher score means better JavaScript performance. The Android 2.2 browser on Atrix is the second. It scored 255 points. Nexus 1 is coming up. The Android 2.3 browser on Nexus 1 scored 187 points. The V8 test suite is running very slow on Huawei IDEOS with the local browser because the phone has a much lower hardware spec. With Puffing Browser, we can accelerate web page rendering speed and JavaScript performance through cloud computing, even for mobile devices like IDEOS. Finally, the Android 2.2 browser on IDEOS finished the test and scored 14 points.